Hacker666. When playing multiplayer games and online in Minecraft with your friends on a server, be warned, even on realms, you're not safe from this unknown, very eerie hacker. Strap in, grab whatever you may need, soda, popcorn, maybe some nice water, and enjoy the video. But be warned, it could be scary. You have three seconds to like the video. Three, two, one. Did you do it? Guys, thanks so much. I, I want to say... If you haven't liked the video, definitely go do that real quick, guys. It helps out a lot. It lets me know you guys are enjoying the videos, want to see more of the videos. As you guys know, I like delivering you guys and, uh, well, giving you guys uh, a little bit of that, which is uh, some content. So, today we're going to be going over a creepy pasta and a story based around the hacker known as Hacker666 that takes a resemblance and potentially sort of like the form of a distorted version of Herobrine. Odd. Very odd. Now, I don't know about you guys, but when I'm playing on realms and servers and having a wonderful time and just trying to enjoy myself, even maybe perhaps playing some Bad Wars or whatever the case be, sometimes you encounter some very, very weird players. Players unlike any other that I've never even seen before, and they have really weird names. Names that doesn't seem normal. Names that doesn't seem like something you would see so casually playing on a server in Minecraft. And this brings up a lot of scare and a lot of caution. So much caution. So we are back in the creepy puffs world here today. You may be asking yourself, well, 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 OMG, what are you what are you looking to build today? We are going to patch up all this water here. We're gonna patch up all this water, and the reason why we're doing that is because we're actually gonna recreate something here. We're gonna we're gonna make our own well. That's right, our own fountain, really, not a well, but our own fountain. That's right. We're going to craft a fountain of uh, the world, uh, shall I say? So we are gonna go ahead and craft our own fountain here. Uh, and, uh, yeah, we're gonna get the base layout of it out. We're gonna have it kind of coincide directly with this. So it's gonna come out like this. Bada boom. And then I'm thinking, uh, nope, 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 nope. Not like that. But then it's gonna come out, well, we need to come out a little bit more. So we're gonna place some grass here. Um, a little bit more. And I'm thinking from there. Wait just a second. This has to be perfect now. All right. We want to then do this. And then from here to here, we're going to have it branching out. All right, so that's that's the overall starting layout of the fountain. Whew. It's gonna be a it's gonna be a doozy. Anyways, we always like building stuff as we talk about this stuff. But let's dive into this in the first sighting of a hacker six 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 guys. If you see a player named hacker six six six, be warned. Now before we dive into this, let me get a sip of my beverage here. Cheers to anyone watching. That is delicious, guys. All right, so <clears throat> feel really ready to go. So, hacker six 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 in the first sighting. I was playing on a Minecraft multiplayer server with my friends, and the hostess sent us some uh, to some of us to a mine, uh, so we could mine for materials and could build our house. We split up into two mining groups, and well, I led my group down to the deepest parts of the mines. One user tunneled below a stronghold, and most of the group, including me, followed. We couldn't find any diamonds, so I checked our coordinates, and we were where we should be, you know, at exactly at the coordinates that would supply us with a lot of diamonds. So someone suggested that the other group had already been here, and perhaps mined all of the diamonds. After that, we went even further, before giving up and going to the surface. Then, there was one person in the group that yelled, Hero Brian! We all ran to the main city, only for my friend Ellen and I to get lost. My fingers were exhausted from keeping the W key on sprint. The compass wasn't helping because the city was far from the original spawn point. And Ellen told me that we had gone off the map. I was freaking out, and then I noticed a player off in the distance. We ran over to ask them for help, but they just looked at us and raced in the fog. We followed the player, only to be right into a middle of creepers. We screamed and ran in the opposite direction, finding ourselves in the main city. After all the commotion, I only got time to build slightly just before I was able to go to sleep. We then later come and remember that the player was called Hacker666. Well, that's really, really interesting. So basically one of their friends as well goes on to say that they were on a PvP world when suddenly the host raced around screaming and told everyone that pigs were up in the air. They went to check it out and they saw 
a player known as Hacker666, and they all yelled, there's a hacker over there. The players chased around the map, but then the host stopped and told them to further notice the server would be closed. The skin is said to look like Herobrine, but distorted and wrongful, unlike anything you've ever seen. Right, so basically, what does this entail, guys, and what does this tell us? Well, this tells us, okay, this tells us, guys, that there was just another, it was a nice little server, right? You know, a nice little server, nothing too out of the ordinary, um, but some things definitely took a very drastic turn, very drastic turn of events, yeah? Apparently, somehow on this server, a player by the name of Hacker666 joined the server and caused quite the ruckus. So much of a ruckus that the server owner decided to shut it down for good. Was it a wise decision? Perhaps. Or perhaps you could have just banned the player's name so he couldn't join anymore. I'm not exactly sure, but I will say this, guys. It is definitely, definitely weird. And throughout my time of playing Minecraft, I've encountered very, very weird players on servers that have odd names like this. It always puts a little caution in the air and makes me be like, wait a second, I'm not trying to die here or get haunted. My question to all of you out there watching this video, have you encountered any hacker while playing on Minecraft servers? And if you have, what was their name? I'm definitely curious to know because I've encountered a few odd players. We also know that John Doe is something that a lot of people have been encountering, which in my personal opinion is really creepy. So Hacker666 is without a doubt very, very odd. And I don't want to run into him and I don't want him to invade my world. No, not at all, guys. I think I will pass on that, and I'm sure a lot of people can agree. So what am I take on this, and do I think this is a real story? Do I think this is a fake creepypasta? Uh, what do I think, personally? Well, I think it's real. I, I, I think this one's real, and here's why. Here's why I think this creepypasta is real, guys. It, it's definitely not far off to be something that's fake. Uh, by no means, actually. Uh, there's re really no reason to call this one fake uh, at all, uh, in my personal opinion. I think that it has a lot of resemblance of that which is, uh, you know, real, uh, like a real sighting. So personally, Hacker666 really didn't do any major harm, in my personal opinion here. And thus be the case for that, I think that, uh, yeah, I, I, I think ultimately it's not something we need to worry about. Now, if I run into Hacker666... I'm going to be on alert. That's without a doubt. I'm going to be on a lot of alert. Uh, okay, so that doesn't work. First time trying it, guys. I was hoping it was going to work. Oh, well. It's worth a try. <laughs> All right. So, let's see. I guess we'll do it differently, then. Let's try... Yeah, let's just do that. Let's just set, like, a stone sector here. All right. Nice. I tried to add like a little building twist in with this uh, as well, guys, so you guys can get a little bit of building. Yeah, that'll work. There we go, guys. A nice little fountain. Nothing, nothing major. Just something basic. I think it's pretty darn awesome. Nice. I have a nice little fountain there now. It's slowly expanding, guys. Slowly expanding. Now all we got to do is add some more fence alongside this and everything of sorts. So yeah, guys, I think this sighting is definitely real, and I think it's something that we need to be on alert with. Uh, if you see any weird hackers, if you have seen any weird hackers, if there's any uh, weird entities or anything of sort that you would like me to investigate in Minecraft, definitely let me know in the comment section below. Post your theories below as well, guys. As you guys know, I investigate all creepy creepypastas and everything of mysterious sort and uh that's what we do here guys so without a side thank you guys so much and i will see you all in the next video oh my god we're on the rise are we not guys like yeah and i always say this guys and i say this with uh strong clarity share the flipping videos dude we need more people to investigate these creepy pastas to uh kind of give their take on it as well so we can kind of conclude these and uh you don't get further down into the investigation as a whole guys so 
Yeah, share it with your friends. We need to grow. We really need to. We need more people to help us, all right? All right, guys. Have a nice day, and I will see you all in the next one.